I'm Anil Kumar and here is an example of arranging letters in a word. Consider the five letter arrangements of the letters in the word vectors. How many arrangements contain the letter T? And part B is, in how many arrangements do the vowels appear together? So let us try to understand. In the word vectors, how many letters do we have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So in this particular case, N is 7. Is any of the letter repeating? There is no repetition at all, right? So there is no repetition at all. Okay. Now, we need to consider five letter arrangements. So let's put five positions. 1, 2, 3, 4. Five. How many arrangements contain the letter T? Let us say we make an arrangement with letter T. In that case, we could have four other positions and these four positions are filled with seven. Out of seven, we have already taken six, so we are left with six, right? So with six letters, we are trying to fill up these arrangements. So that gives us 1, 2, 3, 4. So it is from 6, we are trying to fill up these positions, 4 positions. So 6P4 is the number of A's. Now remember, T, the position of T could be either in the first place or in the second, third, fourth or fifth place. So there are 5 positions for T. And for each position, we have same number of ways of permutations. So it should be multiplied by 5. And therefore, the total arrangements will be 5 times 6P4. Right? So that is how you could calculate this answer. Correct? So, now let's move on to the next one. The next one is, in how many ways or arrangements do the vowels appear together now how many vowels are there e and o there are two vowels so basically we have to place e and o together so that is to say let's say we again have five letter arrangement one two three four five and let's say we form a group like this and in this group, we have these two vowels, which are, they are together, E and O, right? Now, this group could be placed in four different positions. We could have EO here, one, then two, three, and one, four, right? So, there are four different positions in which we can place E O right so in that case this should be multiplied by 4 right now for each position there are three places to be filled by the remaining so once you take out 2 from 7 you're left with 5 so the ways to fill these three positions will be 5p3. So total number of ways will be 4 times 5p3. So that is how you could solve this question. Now you can use calculator to calculate the answer. So we have 5 times 6 or 6p4. So we have 6. Well, let's do like this. Let's do 6P4 first, right? 6P4 equals to times 5 equals to 1800. And for the next one, it is 5P3 times 4 equals to 240. So that is how we can solve such question. I hope that helps. Thank you.